Hey I'm Max and welcome to this Unity tutorial. Today we will see how to make our players appear in front of objects or behind depending on where they are. Make sure to subscribe for more tutorials like this and also for full game tutorials. Ok so here's the problem that we're trying to fix. If I go behind this bush, it looks fine because I'm behind the bush, but if I go in front then I'm supposed to look to appear in front. With the house it's the opposite problem, in the front I'm in front so it's ok, but in the back I'm also in front so that's not ok. To fix this you could do multiple things such as changing the order and layer of the object or even if they are in the same order layer as the player you could change the Z value so it appears in front or behind. The problem with this is that you have to do a script and attach it to every object and then check if the player is below or above it to change the Z value or the order and layer and that's not very efficient. So let's see a more simple solution to fix this. Go into your edit project settings, then go into graphics, and here you should see transparency sort mode, default, and sort axis 001. Change the sort mode to custom axis, and change the sort axis to 010. Now let's see how that looks. So I'm, I appear in front of the bush, and when I go behind, I appear behind the bush. And now the house, I appear in front in front, and when I go behind, I appear behind. So let's see how that would look if the house had no box collider, so I'll disable the collider and show you when we go from in front to behind. So as you can see we go from in front to behind in the middle of the object. That's going to work in most cases, if that doesn't work for you, you can also do the trick like I showed earlier of changing the order and layer of the house so you appear behind or in front. If your project is using a pipeline such as the universal render pipeline, you will not see the custom axis here. To be able to change the custom axis you have to go in your renderer that's in your asset. So here I have my pipeline asset and here in my renderer I have the 2D rend and in my 2D renderer you set the custom axis here and the 010 over here. And that should work the same so you see here the bat is behind me and when I move it gets in front of me. Thanks for watching, make sure to subscribe for more tutorials and leave any comments if you have suggestions or questions and I can make a video to explain it to you.